Hi guys, so for today, we're going to make a different content. We're going to make a logo for our class, the Nine St. Anthony. Well, actually, this logo making is a performance task given to us by our math teacher. The purpose of this vid is to document our process in creating the logo. I actually filmed the meeting of the group. For today, we decided to choose the color we're going to use for the logo. I was going to show a few bits from the conversation of the group, but I wasn't able to hit the record button to record the audio from the mic. And... For that, I apologize. At this point, we were still figuring what color we are going to use for our logo. I then remembered the suggestion from my groupmate Leo about the color. He suggested to give it a metallic look. At this point, I was looking for a reference to use for the metallic look. I'm trying to get the color to be more accurate to the reference. Within this vid, I'll be going back and forth to changing the rotation mode of my CP. We tried going for metallic gold, but it ended up with a gradient gold. Choose your fighter. Now I'm trying to add a secondary color, a silver one. Silver one done. Now let's skip a bit. I've already sent them the sample but we're still trying out some possibilities. Now Leanne gave a suggestion. Why don't we try to use the color scheme from the Gifted's logo? At this point, I was trying to study the colors of the logo. I've drawn a comparison of the brownish color from the logo to the color of Bendy and the Ink Machine. Now I'm going to do what's called a pro gamer move. Nah, just kidding. What I'm going to do here is just the same thing I've done before. I duplicated the squares, now I'm trying to change its color by using the eyedropper. Eh, hey, just a little bit. Now we take that pick as a reference for the blue and the brown. Choose your fighter. Lightning inspired. Fight. Fight. Now I'm going to try and position them. Well, the results kind of okay.
At this point, I wasn't still satisfied with my work because I thought that there's still some improvements that can be made to make it more better. Now I've already sent them the sample of the colors and shapes. Now the things you're going to see is just me trying to mess around with the shapes and the letters. If you want to leave the vid, you can now. Bro, what are you doing? Well, this is the part where I turned it into 3D shapes. And this is the part where I look for the right font, the same as the G from the Gifted. And this is the point where I was like, I'm messing around too much with the shapes and just save the project and leave it as it is. So that was it for day one color. Oh, are you still here? Well, great. Thank you. Thank you very much for watching. Day to vid coming up soon.